Okay, so if you're watching this, it means that we are taking the passies away. Last night, our first step that we did was we reduced her passy collection to two passies. She usually sleeps with four of them, but we took two of them out of her room. So we just said that they must have been lost, which I felt so bad for saying that and Drew did too. But now she has two passies left. So what I'm going to do, I'm gonna give some light here so I'm not talking in the dark, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut a little hole in each of them and then um, when she tries to suck on them, they will feel like different than normal and then hopefully we can say they're broken and we can just end up throwing them away and she can help me like throw them away and then we'll say she's a big girl. So that is the idea, but we'll see how it goes. So right now I got my scissors and I'm going to snip a little hole in each of them. So what I did here is you can see the little hole that I snipped in each of them. It's like that and then when you suck on it, it lets air in so it doesn't feel the same so we're gonna see what she thinks about that and I will update you guys after nap time to let you guys know what happens oh. mama shield It is the next morning since I gave that little update about Bryn's passies and you saw the little clip of her rocking for the first time and noticing one of them had a little hole in it. So now it has been an entire day later, so the next day for her nap we ended up throwing away um, her gray passy. So now she is down to one passy. It still has a hole in the top of it and she's definitely noticing when she puts it in her mouth she'll say that her teeth hurt but it's just because the air is coming through and I think she feels that something's different. So she's been holding it more so that's a step. We have to get that one gone from her. I'm not sure if I'm going to throw that one away today or if I'm going to wait until tomorrow to do that but I'll keep you guys updated throughout this vlog. But there's still a pretty decent sized hole in there so we might just make it a little bit bigger today and then tomorrow we'll throw it away. But how we threw the other one away and we were talking about how it was broken and I said do you think we should throw it away because it's broken? And at first she was saying no and then she, and then I asked her again right before she went to bed and she said yeah. So we threw it away. So she went over to the trash and she threw it away and then she kept asking where it went but she would tell herself. She would say where'd the passy, the great passy go and then she'd say broken so she knows that that one was broken so hopefully it goes the same with this one you know by the end of the vlog um, what happens with the passies because they should be gone by the time that I post this video it did get a little harder to put her down to sleep because she asked to rock a couple more times now that she doesn't have all the passies I'm hoping that that's just a little phase to get her over um, the pacifiers because I know she probably just feels the comfort from rocking like she did from the pacifiers I still have to get her up this morning. Um, it is about 9.30 right now. Jet's right here. We have the Christmas tree on. Hi, Jet. And I just heard Bryn, so I'm going to go get her up. But today is Drew's birthday, so I think we're going to make him some birthday muffins, some banana, some chocolate chip banana muffins, because we don't have any cake mix in the house. So I think we're going to do that. And then tonight, Drew and I are going to go out on a date to go shopping. And we're looking for a couple things for the new house, so I'm going to bring you guys along with us. Good morning. How did you sleep? No poopoos. No poopoos? Did you have some pee pee in your diaper? No. <laughs> How'd you sleep? No pee -pees. Oh, you didn't have any pee? No. <laughs> You're silly. Are you ready to get up? Brittany, did you know that today's daddy's birthday? Yeah. Should we make him some banana muffins? Yeah. And we can put a candle in them? Yeah. Would that be fun? Yeah. <laughs> Do you know how old daddy is? How old do you think Daddy is? 26. Yeah. Is that old? Brittany two. Brittany is two. Mama, four. Mama's four? Yeah. Oh, I thought Mama was 25. Yeah. 
Mama put pretty lights on the Christmas tree. Yeah. Let's go see it. Uh-oh, brother's crying. What do you think of the tree? Do you like them? Is it pretty? Jet is taking a little nap, so Brinny and I are going to go make some cupcakes for Daddy's birthday. Are you excited? Yeah. Okay, let's go. And here we have the finished product, and we just got done eating breakfast, too.
Okay, I'm trying to keep my camera low because there's someone parked right next to me and I feel a little bit awkward, but I'm in the car. I just finished pumping and I just checked on Jet and Bryn. They're doing good, but I think Bryn's getting a little bit tired. We're running into Home Depot right now. I actually found a lot of good stuff at Home Goods and I basically manifested myself this recliner in the back because um, I talked about it like all week and then Drew uh, agreed to get it. So it's back there. We could barely fit it in. We had to take down um, the, both of the baby's car seats. So we're gonna have to leave it at Drew's parents when we pick them back up. But we are going to Home Depot. We're getting some flooring samples. I'll show you guys those when we get home. And I have to go because this guy's looking at me. Just walking around looking for Drew. He said he would be in the flooring aisle when I called him and he's not here. But waiting for him to pick out some samples to bring home and then when we get to go into the house for the first time we'll be able to bring these samples with us and we'll be able to have it when we pick out paint colors too. Drew, can, like you, can you walk me through what flooring we're going to be picking out here? Yeah, so this is like a red oak, um, <laughs> vinyl plank, Walton oak. Which one do you like the best? First glance. First glance, first glance. What is the most goth one? No, find one that you actually like. One of these two. We are back from shopping and I have a little haul here for you guys. These are Christmas presents that have been coming in the mail. I've been piling them up, some for Drew, and then uh, most of them are all for Bryn. But I'm going to be doing a what I got my toddler for Christmas coming up here soon. So keep an eye out for that. I also got some stuff tonight for her that I will wait to show you until then. But I wanted to show you at least a couple things. So this sign I got for our toy room in the new house, I thought it was perfect. Because it says let them be little and it will be for like a little kid's toy room. And then yeah, this is what it looks like. And it's pretty big. And then also, oh, these are some toys in here that will be for the toy haul. And then also I'll save some of the stuff that I got her for her stocking to show you. This is more, more toys. Let me see if there's anything that I can show you right now. Oh, I got a shower curtain. Let me get that out here. It's from the Hearth in Hand brand. I thought it was really pretty. So, there's that. And then also, I got a new book. Don't mind the random, like, grocery stuff in here. But I got a new book. I will let you guys know how this is, but it's called The Orphan Sisters. It's called The Orphan Sisters, and I looked it up on Amazon to look at the reviews before I got it. And um, they were pretty good, so I decided to get this. And there's seriously a ton of toys in here. Like, I went overboard for Bryn. Even though I stuck to her budget, it just seems like a lot of stuff. I might have to take a couple things back because I don't want her to have a million presents to open for Christmas and um, be too spoiled. So I'll let you guys know what I decided to do in the video where I show everything that I got her for Christmas. I can't wait to make that video because I love just getting everything out and looking at it. And then I'm going to also wrap it all and I'll probably do a wrap with me. I forgot to update you guys on the Passy situation. So before she went to bed tonight, I snipped a little bit more of the tip of her Passy off. So there was a bigger hole and she had the funniest reaction. So she put it in her mouth and she sucked on it for like two seconds like two little sucks and then she took it out and she said this is spicy and she put it on the ground and she kind of like laughed about it like she thought it was funny but she could tell that something was different about it and then I rocked her and she just kind of like kept taking it out of her mouth and picking at it with her little finger she was like picking at the hole and she could definitely tell that it was broken I asked her if she wanted to throw it away and she said no and she just kept putting it back in her mouth and then taking it out so I just let her hold on to it for tonight and I just encouraged her to like keep it out of her mouth and I said, oh, maybe we should just hold it since it's broken. And I'll let you know in tomorrow's video if anything's changed and if we've been able to throw it away yet. I might give her a couple more days just to let her like keep holding on to it in bed and we'll see when she decides to throw it away. That's going to be all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. We had a good time shopping tonight. That was the first time that we left Jet. And it was a lot of fun because we got to just have time to shop and not have to worry about taking any of the kids with us. So, there's Drew. Drew, how was your birthday? 
freaking sucked. What? But that's going to be all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button so that you can see tomorrow's video coming up. And I will see you guys in the next video for Vlogmas. Bye.